Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Anna. Happy birthday to you. Today, today is my daughter's birthday. 11th birthday. Her right here. Her, she's 11 years old. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Daddy loves you so much. Oh, please stop growing. You need to be baby Anna again. So this is the first official trip to my daughter's school from the old house. From the new house, I mean. Oh, it's going to take us about 30 minutes to get there. So we have to leave early. What time is that? 15? So it's 15. Let's see how long it takes to get there. So I just dropped off my daughter. I had her daycare. She heads for school. And I cannot believe today is her 11th birthday. I can remember vividly the day she was born. <sighs> it's the best, best day of my life. Best moment of my life. You know, before I met, before I had my daughter, I was a different person. You know, I never, I was pretty self-absorbed, very selfish. But you know, when I got my daughter, you know, it, it changed my priorities. That Anastasia became my number one priority. Making sure she was happy, making sure she was doing the right things, making sure I was a good father and a provider for her. And she's like the light of my life. She's the reason why I get up in the morning now and, you know, try to provide for her, make sure her life is going to be better than what my life is. You know, every day, I, you know, and now I can't believe she's 11 years old. There's going to be her last year at uh, elementary school, and then next year she'll be in middle school. You know, it's just time flies, guys. You have to enjoy these moments because they go by quick. And before you know it, snap your finger. They're growing up and they're out of the house. <sighs> but I do wish she was a little baby again. I was holding her in my arms that day. It was a Tuesday, I remember. Holding her in my arms, loving every moment of it. <sighs> so. Happy birthday, Anastasia. Daddy loves you very, very much. A lot to do this morning since I'm on this side of town. I gotta drop off some packages that I sold on eBay. Gotta go back to the old house to pull in the trash cans. And I gotta go pick up my son's futon. That was another busy morning again for your old boy, Ronnie Bizzle. Well, here I am back at the old house. Hope my days are numbered here, but gotta stop by and get these trash cans. Early morning trip to Walmart to get my son's futon, so I'm not to sleep on the floor. Futon picked up. Not that heavy, I feel like 20 pounds. Yeah. Now my son can sleep on a bed. Set up on the floor. So this is pretty good. I made pretty good time here. It is 8:36 in the a.m. I left the house at 7 o'clock, so I, I was able to take care of all my errands within within an hour and a half. Not bad. So I was a little worried about uh, being at the new house and not being able to run all these errands because I'd be, you know, taking up a lot of my time. But it shouldn't be that bad. I went to uh, three different places and did everything I had to do. So. I'm going to head home now, probably take another 15, 20 minutes, 9 o'clock, I can go take a shower, and then I can get to work. So this means, on days that I have to do errands, I don't need to go take a shower early in the morning, I can do it at the regular time, and still get to work on time. So let's go! You uh, younger viewers and millennials probably have no clue what this thing is. Alright guys, I just got off work It was one of those days where it wasn't Wasn't good it Wasn't terrible. It's more below average so in so many words it kind of sucked today, but 
Gotta go, that's the flow of dealing. You have your ups and you have your downs. <laughs> that was corny, I, I know that was corny. Anyways, I guess uh, I couldn't be happy all day, I guess, because it is my daughter's birthday, so I had to uh, balance it out, the yin and yang of life, you know. Gotta be sad, gotta be happy. You can't be one emotion all day long. So I am heading out to Chili's now, because that's where my daughter wants to have dinner and celebrate her birthday. So let's go. Chili's, Chili's to celebrate my daughter's 11th birthday. We're heading out to Chili's. The bar's open. Huh? It said only the bar's open. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! My love. Happy birthday! Happy birthday. There's the birthday girl. Say hello. Hello. There's the birthday dinner for the birthday girl. Woohoo, you love that? Yeah. Bacon. And then, and then our dinner. Uh, they kind of skip us some beef. We have more, I think we have more broccoli than That's beef. Good. All right, everybody, you got a birthday. Who's over here? Yep. It's your birthday? How old are you? 11. Oh, God, almost a teenager. <laughs> All right, let's sing a song for you. One, two, three. Happy, happy birthday from the Chili Street. Wait, 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 don't get the go through it. The chocolate, the chocolate chip cookie ice cream. Oh, yeah. Tear it up. Nom, 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 nom. First bite. Take the first bite, Anna. Yummy. Happy birthday, one more last time. Happy birthday, one last time. Happy birthday, dear Anastasia. Happy birthday to you. I put the Anna. Huh? Huh? Happy birthday to Bobby. Anna. <laughs> My cold daughter because it's freezing out here. Hi. Hey. So, let's end the vlog, Anna, shall we? Yeah. If you like this video, Please comment, like, subscribe. Please share it with your friends. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. And once again, happy birthday. One last time. Ah, one last time.